at the recent eLearning Africa Conference 2024 in Kigali, Rwanda. We recognize that relying solely on browser-based text-to-speech output is insufficient for supporting all spoken languages and dialects, to enhance personalization and diversify language and content. We have introduced two highly requested types of comments, which complement the existing format. Since Leah script version 0.15.7, you can now add audio or video recordings to your comments. To play and hold your file during your animation step, simply attach the multimedia link at the end of your comment. Or add it to the front. Of course, you can also combine multiple comments. The playback will occur in the order they appear in the document. We had a lengthy discussion and brainstorming session on where to add the video record, so it remains visible without affecting the user experience. Our solution? Let the user decide. The user can choose where to place the overlaid video and adjust its size based on their screen size orientation and resolution. To add short video content, simply include a video link at the beginning or the end of your comment. As before, you can combine multiple comments which will be replayed in sequence. And I hope this idea is pretty simple or straightforward. So if I change the presentation properly to slide mode which shows the, the, the comments written out. So you can always go back and forth between those uh, simple steps. We had a lengthy discussion and brainstorming set. Jump to the next one. To add short video content, simply include a video link. And add your, not your face and your voice, actually a more personal uh, perspective onto this uh, educational step that you are actually presenting at the moment. The user always have the, has the opportunity to hide the video content so that only the audio uh, is replayed in a certain step. If I go back to, if you are wondering how to create some of uh, these snippets, probably you don't have to have your own recording system online. You can do everything within the browser. So for this case, we simply added like three new buttons or features. Let's do a demo, like one, two, three, four. Let's do our first audio recording. This is my first audio recording demo. So this will replay the this text. This is my first audio recording demo. To speech output generated, but I've, uh, you now want to add your voice, simply click on this audio recorder, onto the record button. This is my first audio recording. If you select this, you can replay it. This is my first audio recording. Improve it probably, you can download this into your desktop or laptop or whatever, or you can simply add this uh, into your current document. In this case, everything also is stored only within the browser. So if I close this, we can try this out. So I'll leave some space so the uh, these elements are detached and will only show This is my first audio this audio file. This is my first audio recording. Okay, and so if we want to combine them, we simply remove the space. We recompile this. This is my first audio recording. And now whenever an animation step or the comment is replayed, it will try to use this audio recording. And if you can do the same, if you want to uh, do this with a video, this is my second recording of the video. Let's add this to animation step two. And do the same. Well, we click on this webcam recorder. Uh, you can choose between different quality levels, uh, but the encoding basically, there's a, a small bug at the moment with the uh, encoder. So you have to choose highest quality, which does not do any encoding afterwards. 
but if you start record this is my second recording of a video now I hope you like this feature you can replay it also delete this or download this into your computer the same or simply insert it into the old document click on insert it's in the web M format uh, you can also inspect this if this worked or not let's remove the sound so there's this video this is my second recording of a video now it works and we simply attach this to the beginning uh, this as a beginning starting link uh, if you want to recompile this and if we now add so let me include it Use this with this comment text we add sound this is my first audio recording this is my second recording of a video now I hope you like this feature go back and forth this is my and we'll do the same and if you have some very interesting stuff to present probably directly from your desktop you can also do this desktop recording which does the same let's do it also in high quality wait a second uh, we can start this it will ask me which window or the entire screen or chrome tab uh, let's do the entire screen this one uh, share this and you now can do this recording of whatever uh, so in this case it's not that interesting basically because it's showing the entire the original video but you can use this to record any kind of app or whatever you want to uh, present and you can also download this or insert this also as a content into a video step and let's do it like on animation step one this is my first audio recording this is my second recording of a video now i hope you like this feature so i hope you enjoyed i uh, use this in the future and i hope to see a lot of um, open educational resources in the future that uh, make use of this and create more interactive and engaging content thank you very much